Okay, so your design is done. It is all traced. It is completely ready to go, so you can now transfer this onto your magnet. Um, also, you can use the tracing boxes for these if no one's on the tracing boxes. You would literally fold them backwards and then go like this, and you'll see through it. It makes sense if you're over there. So use tracing boxes if no one's on it. Um, now, your carbon paper, there's a shiny side and a dull side. Okay, the shiny side has to go down on the magnet. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your finished design and you are going to take a pencil, which I don't see over here, so I'm going to use a pen. Oh, it's not a pencil. And you are going to trace around your circle onto the carbon paper and you are going to cut it out so it matches your circle. Okay, so you can kind of see the line on there. It's really faint. So you're going to cut it out, and it's going to match your circle. So here is one. You are then going to take your design. You're going to take your cutout carbon paper, and it is shiny side down. And you're going to put it on your magnet like this. Now, there are paper clips on my desk. You should already know where they are. It's in this little basket. You're going to paper clip it to the magnet, just like this. Okay, so you can see the magnet, the black side's the magnet, the white side you're gonna be on. And you, all you have to do is take a pencil and trace over what you have here. And you don't need to push hard, you're just gonna push, just trace, and it will literally trace it right onto your magnet. Once this is completely traced, you'll take it off, and then you are going to color yours with Sharpie. Now, it's a little weird. Here's another one. This is Elisa's. It looks awesome. Um, it's a little weird because this carbon paper, this black carbon paper, it leaves that black residue on your magnet. So you want to do all your actual coloring first. Then you will outline it with a black Sharpie last. So color first, outline it last. You can use any color scheme you want. You can color it with any colors you want. This is all for you. And you take a photo and turn it into Schoology. So just to reiterate, you finish your actual design, you will trace it and cut out the carbon paper. Carbon paper goes shiny side down, so it's magnet, carbon paper, design, and you paper clip it on, trace it with a pencil. You don't have to push hard at all, it just comes right through. You then will color it with Sharpie, and then you will outline it. Um, it should take just a couple class periods to completely finish it. Uh, good luck!